Hi there, once again, welcome back to my channel. Consider subscribing if today is your first time and don't forget to turn on post notification so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorials. In today's lesson, I'm going to walk you through how to add an add on domain to your hosting account. I mostly buy my hosting and domain name from Namecheap and it's one of the re reliable platforms that you can buy and host your website. So I just bought a new domain name and then I'm going to use it to demonstrate how to add an add-on domain name to your hosting account. We have add-on and a subdomain name. I'll talk about subdomain in another video. To know more about that, remember to like and share and also subscribe so you don't miss that particular video. So the domain name is Optimum Senior High School. That's actually true how to add this new domain name to your hosting account. Okay, so once you buy a hosting, you're gonna have a hosting platform where you store all your files. And this is my main hosting account over here, the cPanel. I've opened this in a new tab and this is where I have all my files, where I manage my files. So I'm going to walk you through how to add additional domain name to this hosting account. So what you need to do is to move all the way down to domain domains. So we have domains, move all the way down to domain. We have domains, add-on domains, subdomains. So we want to add additional domain. In this case, it's going to be the domain name I bought. Okay. There's the optimus hhs.com. So we will add it as an add-on domain name. So click on that. So when you click on that, the new domain you want to add, that's creates an add-on domain. So that means we have a domain, we have a hosting account with domain names and you want to add additional domain names. So if you check down here, there are several domain names I've already added to this platform. Okay. So I'm adding additional one to this particular hosting account. So I just need to go ahead and type the name of the, this new domain name. So I just go ahead and then type that domain name or you can just go ahead and then copy that name from here. Okay. So in this case, let me just copy this. And then once we go back to accounts, we can just paste it here. So I've pasted it here, but make sure you start this with www. So it's supposed to be like this. And the sub domain name can just be just anything. I'm just going to use the same. So that one is not going to be anything like .com. Just go ahead and then paste. It's going to be just like a file that will hold everything that you host on your website. So the sub domain on this is going to be optimum H shs that is going to be like a file a folder for this particular hosting account so i've done that and you can see the domain root is going to be optimum senior high school .com. so i'll just click on add domain a, and that's all that's all you need to do once you click on add domain a, you can see it will give you this alert add on domain name that's the name of your new domain has been created so if added this to your domain name your hosting accounts and we most of this hosting company will provide will provide you with a free ssl that's secure socket layer normally the padlock you see as part of your domain name so it's going to provide this for you at least for the first year for free so when you get this it will give you some time to automatically configure this some of them will not do that but you need to go ahead and install them manually so i've done that and then i've basically added this as a subdomain name on this particular hosting account thank you so much for watching this short tutorial like come away again remember to always like and share my videos bye bye